all right guys welcome to sasami's crypto youtube channel my name is Solomon gift and on this channel we talk about everything relating to blockchain cryptocurrencies dApps airdrops and being able to maximize all that this ecosystem provides the average user and an investor with so today guys we'll be looking at liquid swap and most importantly how to be able to bridge assets making use of liquid swap and Pontem network from another blockchain EVM compatible blockchain to Aptos blockchain so again guys I know most persons are new to this Aptos blockchain and they've been looking for ways to be able to fund the Aptos blockchain so we've made a video earlier that you can be able to fund your Aptos blockchain by making use of a centralized exchange where you buy the tokens there and you withdraw to your Aptos blockchain it's available on Binance so you can do that but here guys we're talking about how you can be able to bridge making use of layer zero now this video is also important for those that need airdrops because layer zero is very new and they just partnered with them Pontem network to be able to give the users a bridge that they can make use of to port from any other EVM compatible blockchain to the Aptos blockchain so we'll walk you guys through how this is possible but for those that are new please check our previous videos on various Aptos wallets that we've reviewed what you need guys to be able to proceed with this video so that you can be able to bridge your assets and be eligible for an airdrop by layer zero what you need is um, one you need an Aptos native wallet and we've talked about some you can download the Pontem wallet which we've reviewed we have the videos all linked in the description of this video you can download the Matian wallet you can also make use of the future wallet you can also make use of the Petra wallet so you can see there's a Matian wallet there's a future wallet also compatible with this exercise we're about to carry out there's a Petra Aptos wallet also very compatible so you can check them out guys and um, also the Pantom wallet too this is it Pantom Aptos wallet also very compatible with what we're about to do and you, all, and you also need the Metamask wallet you also need the Metamask wallet guys also need the Metamask wallet this is it so what we'll be doing here is um, we'll be bridging some assets from our ethereum wallet to our aptos wallet again we'll be bridging from our ethereum wallet being the ethereum blockchain making use of metamask to our aptos wallet making use of matian but note you can also make use of pontem wallet and you can also make use of petra wallet or future wallet or making use of matian now why are we making use of matian it's because we have already funded our Matian wallet so because you will need some Aptos tokens to pay for gas fees so we've already funded our Matian wallet with about 1.99 Aptos tokens and one of the reasons we did that too was because of this whole exercise so we did a video that you can watch to see how you can fund this wallet from a centralized exchange so for those that don't know how to please check the description and you'll see that video now next we already have our metamask wallet to funded reason is because of gas fees you need some ethereum to pay for gas fees this is because we are bridging from our ethereum wallet to the aptos wallet now mind you guys you can also still bridge from your avalanche wallet or polygon wallet to the aptos wallet but in this video we're bridging from ethereum so next guys um we have bridge.liquidswap.com opened now what you want to do next is you want to connect your wallet guys so you can see the options for connecting for the evm you can connect via metamask or coinbase wallet and like i said you're making use of the coinbase you're making use of the metamask wallet so you click on connect and we are connecting to these accounts so next and connect so this is connected and afterwards we have to connect to the Aptos wallet guys so we are connecting to the Matian wallet 
once you click on the connect the Matian wallet and you can see it pops up the Matian wallet and all you have to do is approve this transaction so you can see the description here where it says only approve websites you trust so what you want to do is proceed and click on approve now next as you can see we are connected to our ethereum wallet which is metamask and we are also connected to the aptos wallet which is a matian wallet so next then what token do you want to bridge you can bridge different tokens different tokens guys so here you can see a list of tokens that you can bridge but we're going with ethereum because we have ethereum then the next thing is um if you're bridging ethereum what you'll be getting will be wrapped ethereum and the network is actually the aptos network so you can see that is the aptos network so now next thing you want to do you might want to go to your matian wallet and add the token you'll be receiving so matian wallet has made it easy you can just search for wrapped ethereum via layer zero so this is it and you can just add this for this you'll need a few aptos tokens to pay for gas fees so you can see this is a transaction fee extremely small you confirm and if you notice we now have the wrapped ether as part of our tokens in this wallet now the next thing you can impute how many ethereum tokens you want to bridge now this is extremely important because you need to take into consideration the amount of ethereum you have in your wallet and also gas fees basically so we have very little ethereum so we're just going to impute about 0.02 so as you can see currently there's no minimum so you can see what we're getting is about 2.69 usd which is equivalent to what we are bridging so next you click on transfer and it says you have to register the token first good thing we have already registered the token that was what we did earlier we added it you need to confirm this transaction first in your ethereum wallet so if you don't see this first you need to cancel and try it again but first you need to confirm in your ethereum wallet so if you notice here gas fees is actually a problem the estimated gas fees here is pretty high and the total is about ten dollars which is more than what we have in our wallet because we have about nine dollars in our wallet so you can reject this and we can reduce this to about a dollar so this is one of the major issues with ethereum very high gas fees extremely high gas fees and this is why we're having other blockchains come up and other layer two blockchains coming up so let's try it again guys and let's see how much gas fees will be charged now so extremely so it's still extremely high we're looking at a total of about eight points so we're going to reject this too guys so based on the issues we're having with gas fees we're just going to send few more ethereum to that account just so we can use it to pay for gas fees so let's just paste the address here and we just want to transfer a little ethereum just to cover for gas fees so we're sending about 13 dollars to the account just to cover for gas fees So the estimated gas fees for this sending is just about 33 cents whereas the estimated gas fees for bridging making use of layer zero from ethereum to aptos was as much as six seven dollars so that gives you an idea guys of how expensive this can be sometimes so guys in a few minutes we should be credited with okay here yeah, so it has reflected and can go back to this exercise so we're bridging about 0.003 ethereum which is about four dollars and we're bridging it to aptos so you can click on transfer and you can confirm this in your metamask wallet first from ethereum to aptos all right so here you can see 
so we have a total of about eight dollars estimated estimated gas fees three dollars and the total we're seeing here is about eleven dollars the bridge eight dollars gas fees three dollars total eleven dollars so we can confirm this so we have confirmed that and it's submitting the transaction from ethereum to aptos waiting for block confirmation so the transaction has been submitted here so it's rounding up you can see it here finishing so any moment from now you should be able to see it so while you're waiting you can check your metamask wallet to see if we've been debited yeah from our metamask wallet we have been debited and so the transaction here contract interaction next we need to check our martian wallet to see if we have been credited and here yeah, the transaction has been completed although you can still say finishing here but it has been completed because here you can see we've been credited 0 0.003 ethereum which this is actually layer 0 z meaning layer z layer 0 w meaning it's wrapped ethereum from one blockchain to the other so guys if you check you would notice that even before this completes here was actually shown on this um, liquid swap bridge page it had already reflected in your aptos martian wallet so congratulations guys if you follow through this exercise you have successfully been able to bridge your assets from the ethereum blockchain to the aptos blockchain and you have a chance to qualify for the layer zero airdrop that might be any moment we don't know when exactly but it might be any moment why because you have definitely made use of layer zero to bridge from one blockchain to the other so remember guys you can do this with other blockchains too you can bridge from avalanche to aptos you can bridge from polygon to aptos and a few other evm compatible blockchains too so happy bridging guys and this video is very important for those that are like interacting with centralized exchanges those that like the activities being on chain those that don't like being tracked and those that like having total control of whatever they are doing this video is actually for you guys so here guys you can see this is your wrapped it so here it is you can send this now to another wallet or to someone else and at the same time you can still add other tokens so once you click on the add button you can add them usdt so you can see the layer zero usdt you can add it here very simple you can add the token and you pay with little apt tokens for the fee transaction fee that's it you confirm now you can still choose now you have usdt so that explains everything about this video guys that sums it all up now you can take your time out to experiment with this bridge and also add some tokens on your martian wallet thanks once again guys for watching and don't forget to hit the subscribe button